This video goes with my Home Depot review of the GE Cafe slide-in electric convection range oven um, with steam clean and self-cleaning oven. As you can see, it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, it has four burners and let me shut this top light off. And it won't. It has four burners and a warming burner. Um, I guess because of the reflection that's hard to see, but maybe when I turn them on you'll be able to see it better. So one of the burners has three sizes. It's one, two, three. The left front burner has two sizes. The back left is a medium size. The right back is a small size and the center back is a warmer. Um, the bottom drawer is a warming drawer, so if you want to keep something warm, just put it in here and I believe it keeps it at 150 degrees. So that's wonderful. Inside the oven, you have three racks. It's really quite roomy. It dips down on the bottom. Um, you have this wonderful slide-in rack. And they give you a bottle of graphite in case your uh, racks stick a little bit, they give you a bottle of graphite to put on the on the sliding edges. But this rack is awesome. Um, there you can see the fan in the back. Very, very well made. Excellent quality. Even the guys that delivered the oven stated what a nice oven it was, how heavy it was, how well made. So there's your digital pad uh, which lights up anytime you open the oven door or turn on a knob or see it shuts off and saves you energy there's your clock uh, anytime you turn a knob on this is the oven light anytime you turn a knob on the light around the knob lights up so there's the oven light you can see inside here's each um, knob for each burner so on the top of the, I wasn't you know I'm not I never had a slide in before and I have to say it opens up the whole kitchen area it makes it look bigger and it makes the it makes the top of the stove much roomier I love having the controls on the front I I wasn't sure that I would but now I love it so here's the front burner that's the center lit up there and here's the other side now the larger one you'll see it come up in a minute yeah it's easier to see when it's lit so here we go there's the two sizes and I'll get the other one started with the three sizes you see it, it shows you right on the front Here's your, there's your burners, one, two, three, four, five. So this is the one in the front. And then here it has which size you want to use and what, you know, high, medium, low, and it's numbered. So you're going to turn that on. That's the low one. That's the medium. And that's the big one. So... And it cooks really, really well. Very even heat. Uh, it's just, it's, it's a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful oven. Um, convection converts the temperature for you, so you don't have to convert anything. You just put in the regular temperature, and it does does it for you. There you go. One, two, three sizes. You can see it by the rings. And there's the two. And the one in the back is medium. The center is a warmer, and the back one is the smaller size. So. Um, and there you see the ring around the knob is lit up. I'm going to shut these off. Okay, and you can see the digital pad here. You have your bake, broil, warm, convection bake, convection roast, and then options. There's a proof, which I love because I do make my own bread. Um, clean you have the option of steam clean where you put water in the bottom and 
it steam cleans or you can do a self clean um, a timer of course the warming drawer you can lock it oops and a button for settings before you you know you can hit your bake and your temperature and that and it gives you right here it tells you what to do edit the temperature or um, or options let's press the options see you can delay time you press one or a cook time or a probe it comes with a probe one set delay time and enter the time of day then you would set your delay time and anything you do you have to press start or enter to set it to go so you can fiddle with the buttons all day long but unless you press your start it's not going to start okay so but if you have kids around, you want to lock the controls uh, because they are on the front. Um, when the delivery guys come and install it, they do put a bracket on the wall so it doesn't tip over. Um, what else can I say? It has a lot of options. It's Wi-Fi capabilities, which I have not set up yet. Um, it has Chef Connect. It has... It has so many options. I did have to go online and download the manual, um, but it is, and I would suggest that you do that because there's so much, so much to this, this gorgeous, beautiful, and wonderful of it. <laughs> so it is really, really excellent, awesome quality. It's beautiful. It's, I'm looking forward to using this like for the rest of my life and I'm so grateful to have this and it's just amazing.